What's up guys, it's me again, Crushed Pixel. Let's say you have created an adventure map. And usually this place should be safe. The player should never be able to get out of here because there are these two high walls. But what if the player has jump boost or some special abilities to knock himself up like me? In my case, what I can do is simply get over here and I'm free. But with Minecraft 1.8, Mojang will be adding the new barrier blocks. So what I did, I created a filter um, just to create a barrier around your map how you want it. There are two modes for the filter. The first one is it just creates a barrier around your selection. So in the corner, um, like in the corner of your selection in MC Edit. And the second one is fully customizable. Everything you need is a block of gold and then you put a gold block where your border should start. So for example, um, these gold blocks um, at, at these positions, barrier blocks will be built until the um, build limit at y equals 256. So, I'm just going to place it like this because I want barrier black blocks to be there. And I'm going to MC Edit to show you what you can do with that. So, I'm here in MC Edit and now I'm going to show you how to apply the filter. So, in the first case um, that we want to um, protect a square region. What we need to do is just um, select it like this. So borders um, of the selection are just around our map. I want the player not to be able to jump out there. So we're going to do it like this probably. Yeah. Then you go to filter and go create barrier. So there are two options now. Um, in my case I do not want to follow the gold blocks obviously because I'm going to do that later. And if I now check whole Y range um, it is basically going to create a barrier at every single block at that specific X and Z position that is uh, not a solid block or, not, or which is an air block so it's going to create a barrier down here and upwards in the sky if I do not check that it will only um, create it above the selection but since I want the whole Y range I will just hit filter and you see these are barrier blocks that's pretty cool um, but before I hit save, uh, I will just show you how to do that with the gold block things. Uh, yeah, it, it's actually enough if I just select all of the gold blocks. Um, then I go filter, and here again I can obviously tell if I want the whole Y range. And this time I check follow gold blocks. Um, yeah. So, I'm just going to hit filter. And you see, it's just in the shape of the gold blocks, and the gold blocks also disappeared. Now, I just hit save and get back to my world and show you how it looks. Okay, so here I am. This um, was the first one with the uh, shape of a cube. And you see, I cannot pass through it uh, anywhere until the build limit and this is actually in the shape of the gold blocks I created so this is very useful for map makers I'm going to um, use this for some custom maps I'm creating or for some plugin maps that uh, I'm working on so this is very useful and you can see uh, this reaches um, until the build limit. Uh, I have not reached it yet because it's 255 and yeah 
this is pretty cool. There is nearly no way of getting out of um, this uh, cool stuff thing. Oh yeah, here I reached it. And now I can jump in. Yay! Thanks for watching. The filter download is as always in the description. See you in the next video. Bye!